Hey everybody and welcome back. So in this episode I'm going to see Desdemona about that quest to do with the Institute. The rumor is true. One of our agents has made it inside the Institute. Is this what Tinker Tom was working on? Yes, Tom's work is related. But the device and the assembly was the Wanderer's doing. After the device was assembled, he made it inside the Institute and then back out. Where is the Institute? We're not sure exactly. Best guess is that it's somewhere under the old CIT. But they've been using a teleportation device to get in and out, so it could be anywhere. What did he find out? I know you all have questions, but I've said everything I'm going to. But know this. The ops you're planning and running now are the most important of our lives. We have a chance at rescuing more sins than we ever dreamed of. So get it done. Tinker Tom's cooking up. There's Demona. Have Nova you met with better Patriot? than last time. I met Patriot. His name is Liam Benet. I knew you'd get the job done. We need every scrap of intel you picked up in there. Write up a full report on Pam's terminal. After you're done, we'll analyze it and figure out the next step. Get to it. Uh, what? Alright, do, do I actually have to write this report? I suppose you're here for my benefits. Preliminary analysis complete. Anything we need to move on? Affirmative. Code name Patriot requires admin credentials for code defender security software. Cross indexing CIT security administrators with 2077 Commonwealth Census records. Filtering by surviving structures. One match found. Bergman, Wilfred, Bergman, Wilfred, registered as co owner of Cambridge Polymer Labs. Estimated 81% chance of login credentials being located at this facility. What's at Cambridge Polymer? Cambridge Polymer Labs, LLC, had several active military contracts specializing in robotics. The region is currently classified as extremely dangerous. After you get the password report back here, with any luck, we'll have a game plan by then. Haven't I been to Cambridge Polymer Labs? Yeah. It's literally right next to CIT. Yeah, it's good. Like, some of these armor variants look really good. The thing is, they're like when you see them here, they're like the top level armor range which means they're very hard to sort of make, you can only make them if you're level like 40 or something or you can pay an insane amount of money and get them in vendors maybe but yeah that's sort of what I'm working towards now is making an armor set like that whether or not I'll get there is another thing before I uh, finish the game. Welcome to the Cambridge Polymer Labs. Employment opportunities await in the field of scientific research. Shall we begin your application now? Sure, I'm game. Let's begin the interview. Due to increased demands for staff in all fields, we have condensed the employment test accordingly. Question one. Do you possess previous experience with polymer synthesis? Sounds like you need me regardless, so let's get down to brass tacks. Calculating test results. I am pleased to offer you the position of sales coordinator. Expect a loquacious future in haggling for military funding. Would you like the orientation before beginning your work in the labs? Orientation? The orientation is intended to provide the new employee with a history of the company to enrich their working experience. Would you like the orientation before beginning your work in the labs? Uh, sure. sure. 
Why not? Wonderful. Find an open seat, and we will begin the presentation. <laughs> All right. Please find an open seat, and we will begin the presentation. The genesis of Cambridge Polymer Labs lies in the research of a group of brilliant graduate students. John Elwood, Erica Woolham, and Wilfred Bergman met during their time together at CIT. This slide shows them at their graduation. Their research into nucleostrictive and piezoelectric polymers caught the attention of Colonel George Kemp in the fall of 2073. In the spring of 2074, the company was founded with a generous grant provided by the Defense Experimental Research Project Initiative. The research produced here has resulted in several of the components used in the Liberty Prime Project that led to the successful defense of Anchorage. The company enjoys a strong relationship with the military and welcomes your addition to the research team that helps build a better America. Please follow me to the research lab so that you may begin your work. Complimentary beverages are provided for employees. Please label any food or cigarettes you leave in the break room. <laughs> I can't... Alright, can I like leave? Oh, I Alright, somewhere over there I need to be. May as well follow this one. Sales staff are provided with a business suit, the cost of which will be deducted from the first commission. Please take a look to dress in your proper work attire and follow me into the clean room. The research staff will greet you on the other side of the clean room. Thank you for your attention, and welcome to the team. Please enter the clean room. I have been instructed to inform you that Director Elwood has issued mandatory overtime due to contamination detected. I am confident. Has the staff will not be allowed to leave the job until the piezo nuclei lining project has been completed. What the hell? Dr. Elwood Wolla for specific research assignment. Starting decontamination sequence. Contamination detected. What the hell? Uh, I think there's a ton of ghouls in here. <laughs> Just saying. Upstairs, probably.
until I get across there. Before I die of radiation poisoning. Can't break the code. Cool. They're not looking to kill me. That's good. Uh. Heads up. No way I'm cracking this. Wait there. Come on. Go check that out. Ah, you're a robot. How can you not hack something? How do you not know how to hack something? Is that thing able to get out now? I need one more and I can throw that in there then and see what happens don't know what I'm doing That's a smoke grenade, what am I doing? Look at that. Okay, what am I doing? What am I doing? Is there even anything here for me to use?
Aha! Unknown sample. Okay, let's see where this goes. Radioactive isotope. Okay, let's go and test out that uh, thingy. It's called uh, the terminal. I'm sure there, there might be something there. Though. No. Oh, is this? This is just bloody. All right. Okay. That's just for the doors. Tells me and gives me no help whatsoever. Lithium high hydride and gold. What? Where? Uh, where are the other stuff then? Like the other reagents that I need. Ah, okay. There's a good chance I might actually die in this room. What am I supposed to be doing? <laughs> I'm like, uh, just yeah, no idea. Ah, right, I'm gonna keep trying this until I get something.
Ah, uh, yep, never mind. Accidentally hit the button twice. Security's too tight. Heads up. Hacking this is beyond me. Check it out. At this time, I cannot do that. Oh god. Okay, is there anything in here that could be of help? Yeah, I can't really say I'm fully beyond loading up an old uh, save <laughs> if I can't get through this or like figure out what it is I'm supposed to do. Because as far as I know, both uh, reagents I have equipped currently are wrong. Hello. Aha. Oh. Stay down, bitch. Okay, so I got that. Uh, okay. Oh, they set to kill everything now. That's not good. Is that Kiri? No, that's Kiri, so what's that? Wait, I don't have to do this, do I? If, she, if Molly got in here, then she had to go through that door. Which means... Hallelujah. But out of curiosity, though, did I actually get those... Did I actually get, like, what I needed?
Hey. So is this for my power armor? I think so. <laughs> I mean, yeah, Model E. No, okay. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna give that to Kiri. Look alive. You need something, yes? Look alive. Are you giving me a present? Yeah, of sorts. Three hundred and sixteen. Did I, did I take everything I give her? Oh, what? what's going on? How have I how have I got two hundred and ninety two? Yeah, I took everything back, didn't I? Ugh. Yeah, I'm very positive though, I'm not pressing any buttons to cause that. But it's cool though, that I got a new chess piece for the power armor I got. Model E. Hmm. Okay, return to Desdemona. Goodbye, Molly. Right. Now oh, that was fun. I am um, gonna I'm gonna fix that bit onto my power armor next time I'm in Sanctuary Hills and see how it looks. Defender password for Patriot. Excellent work. On our side, we've gone through your report. It was extraordinary. So many pieces of the puzzle clicked into place. Our final analysis indicates the Institute is far more formidable than we ever feared or imagined. If we stage a mass breakout, Patriot's 13 synths will undoubtedly be the last we ever save. Instead, we use this one chance to rescue all the synths. Every last one of them is that even possible hopefully patriots core escape plan will scale up if it can't well we'll deal with it as it comes the institute will never let their slaves go without a fight so the heart of our problem is manpower even if we call in all our agents and we will we won't be able to hold our own against the institute for long talk with c114 if the synths down there want freedom, they must fight and risk their lives to earn it. Even with synth allies, is that enough to fight the Institute? The synths greatly outnumber the scientists. If enough of them rebel, the chaos would be unprecedented. Then we use that turmoil to evacuate everyone we can. It will work, because it must. As much as we owe Patriot, we can't be certain how committed he is. 
If he learns we're willing to kill to free sins, he may not have the stomach for it. So get what you need from him and then cut him loose. Good luck. We're all with you. Deacon's record is the best. Okay. So let's go meet this guy and talk to the synth. Wow, almost level 31. Oh yeah. Discussed into position, but tell me, do you think Mr. Benet's plan will work? A better plan is to use this opportunity to rescue everyone, but Sins will have to fight for it. And I thought Mr. Benet's plan was too ambitious. Of course, I'd fight for my freedom. And I know of a few others that might as well, but enough to face all the guards. Perhaps if we stand up openly to the scientists. More of my people would join us, yes. Even if most don't join the fight, certainly there are many others who have been waiting their whole lives for this. But we should be prepared for some of the sins to fight against us. All people want to be free. They just need the opportunity to take it. I... I don't know. It's a gamble. I admire Mr. Beignet a great deal. We can't tell him about this plan. It's his people we'll be fighting. I will talk to my friends. Meet me here tomorrow. If I don't make our appointment, assume the worst. Okay. And let's go and talk to that guy. Mr. Binet. You get me what we talked about? And I'm in business. Liam, I got your username and password. You railroad guys really deliver, you know? Hooking that ancient tech up to the modern terminals is going to be seriously time-consuming. Even with that password. So hand it over and I'll get started. This is a delicate operation. Are you okay if we have to use violence? Good question. If we find ourselves in that position, we pull the plug and wait for another opportunity. We can't risk anyone's life over this. Here you go. Great. Listen. I need a favor. Z-114 is working the atrium again. Can you give him an update? It's safer if you do it. Okay. I have to wait a day now. So I'll take a seat here. And just sit in the cafeteria for 24 hours. Yeah, because this ain't weird. No one's going to ask questions about that. Like, why is it the son of the leader just sitting there doing nothing for an entire day? Oh, I can't stop yawning. This is why I shouldn't play games at 3 a.m. Many others will join us, but we will fight and die very quickly unless we have weapons. A lot of them. Given the right materials, we can make our own crude but serviceable weapons. Unfortunately, we're missing a few critical ingredients. What ingredients? Gunpowder, laser focusing crystals, and a couple other things. Couldn't we just steal some weapons? All munitions are tightly guarded by the SRB. Even if we manage to take some, it would certainly be noticed. And surprise is essential to everything. I have weapons I can give you. Excellent. Deposit anything you can spare in maintenance closet 3B. 
but we need enough weapons to arm an entire rebellion. So the ingredients are still necessary. Okay. Tell me how I can help. We've come up with a plan to get what we need. The Institute's always expanding. Excavation just completed on one of the sublevels. The mining equipment has been packed into crates and they haven't been moved yet. That equipment has everything we need. Thanks to Mr. Binet, the construction crew is populated solely by my friends. But they're under constant supervision. How do you feel about killing some guards? Who's guarding them? A good number of early models since. Will that be a problem? I'll do it, if it's necessary. <sighs> we could come up with no other way. After you eliminate the guards, we'll move the supplies and blow up the tunnels behind us. To the SRB, it will be a tragic construction accident that killed many synths. Rare, but not unheard of. And then, our dead friends can assemble the weapons we need. Good luck. What am I... What? Okay, I'm going this way. Cool. Ah. That's the locker. But... Where am I going? Guessing it's over here. Oh, well, this looks like crap, doesn't it? Scanning unknown identity sensor by order of the Institute of Wow. Okay, I'm just gonna grab all the guns that I can get and uh, walk very slowly over to. Okay, not all of these had guns for some reason. Not guns that I can get to anyway. And then walk very slowly away and put some of these guns then into that uh, locker. Might not be a lot, but it should be enough.
Yeah, and this might just be me trudging along towards that locker. <laughs> Actually, no, if I take buff out, I should be fine. Hey. challenge remaining is keeping all of this secret from the SRB so we're being very careful which unfortunately takes time for now please continue working with father we can't afford for him to grow suspicious when my people are ready I will contact you Okay, better go and talk to... What's her face? this operation about hey relax we wouldn't send you off without the proper information recent events have upset our timetable getting the reactor online has become our number one priority it needs to be running well yesterday we're going to have to cut some corners I'm not thrilled but it means we'll need to rely on some pre-war tech you're going to the mass fusion building to acquire a beryllium agitator for us what's a beryllium agitator the details would be lost on you no offense the point is, it'll allow us to boost the reactor's power and get it running sooner than planned. You just keep me safe. I'll worry about the agitator. Is that really necessary? I'm sure I can handle this by myself. Yes, it really is. Not only is this tech sensitive, it's old. Look, I'll take care of it. You just make sure I come back in one piece. Can do. Sounds good. I'd appreciate the company. Not as much as I'd appreciate coming back in one piece. I don't like going above ground unless there's no other option. But here we are, with our options dwindling quickly. Not to put more pressure on you, but we have to move quickly on this. Word is that the Brotherhood is nosing around the area. We don't want them getting the agitator before we do. Head on up to the relay, and I'll meet you there. Uh, 
Alright, I need to get rid of some of these. I, I don't know what that is. I'm curious to find out though, so I'm gonna go and see if I can find this guy. A house dif divided. I got like five minutes and then I have to call it quits. For goodness sake, be reasonable. I know you can hear me. Now open this door. Uh, what's the use? What's going on? Dr. Higgs and Dr. Loken have decided to protest your appointment as father's successor. They've taken control of the bioscience security systems and cut off our food supply. Have they made any demands? Not yet, but I expect they'll demand that you renounce all ties to the Institute. Is there a way I can communicate with them? As a matter of fact, there is. I can unlock the maintenance tunnel that leads to the bioscience observation room. From there, you should be able to communicate with Higgs and Logan. If you can't reason with them, you can use this holotape to access the command functions on the observation room terminal. That should give you some options. Just please, try to talk to them first. Use violence only as a last resort. Okay. Or just give me a moment. There, it's unlocked. Whoa. the guards hmm? impressive excuse me doctor if you come to change our minds then you're wasting your time can we talk about this father chose not to talk to the directorate before anointing you his successor so how about I follow his fine example father believes in me the least you can do is give me a chance no the risk is too great Without experienced and competent leadership, the Institute could be thrown into chaos. Decades of research could be jeopardized. We seem to be at an impasse. Then there's nothing more to talk about, is there? Father's heir apparent. He made it past your impenetrable defenses. What if he got that far? Compose yourself, man. We've always known the risks. We are still in control. Damn it, then that guy said, uh, that guy said I, I got some kind of, like, options here of some description.
Right, Ashley. No, that gorilla is coming for me. No. Oh god, that gorilla actually is coming for me. <laughs> I got the key code. the shit out of me. Goodbye. Okay, so that's the last time I ever travelled in bioscience. Oh, that scared the hell out of me. Doctor, that was unfortunate. We don't like violence here. And I fear your actions will have consequences. What was I supposed to do? Let everyone starve? I don't mean to preach. I simply wish that matters could have been resolved more peacefully. I'll see that the mess in hydroponics is cleaned up. I suppose I should also make the funeral arrangements. Well, there's much to do, so I'll get about it. In the meantime, I'm sure everyone will be relieved that this is over. All right. Nothing to report, sir. I would be happy to assist you. Okay, so I'm going to call this video to an end here. Hope you've all enjoyed the walkthrough. Uh, this episode, I hope you're enjoying the walkthrough in general and the commentary. If you could leave a like, leave a comment down below and hit the subscribe button that should be appearing on the screen at any second now. That would help a great deal and would be very much appreciated. For now, though, that's pretty much it. So until the next episode, you take care of yourself and you have a great day.